Next up then, it is Zenan Poturak of Bosnia-Herzegovina up against Andrei Stojka, known as Mr. K.O. They love him here in Romania. He is Romanian, trains out of respect. And now, ladies gym. and gentlemen, your next bout is a super he's a, cruiserweight he's a big boy as well, 95 kilos. Brought to you by Green World and Louis Purple. Introducing first the fighter out of the blue corner from Bosnia-Herzegovina, Zenan Poturak. Zenan Poturak, trained by his father. Can't get a better button than that. 20 wins to his name, four losses. Weighed in uh, just at weight, both men did. He snuck in at 95 kilos, 209 pounds. They're each very similar. Turak 73 inches, Stoika 74. Turak 31 years old. And his opponent making his way to the ring, finding out of the red corner from Romania, Andre Stoika. Yeah, the crowd got a little bit crazy when his name was announced there. They are these pictures getting pumped up onto the big screen. He is one of the big tickets tonight. He's had 20 knockouts. Incredibly fast fighter for a 95 kilogram man. 26 years old. A little wink to both sides of the crowd. He looks cool and calm. I think it's fantastic that these shows are being put on now where you're getting the uh, this level of fighter on. Uh, kickboxing, you're used to getting like the Ben Aharis, uh, Remy Bonyaskis, and people like that, the top tier guys. And it's about time that the people, the young the young talent coming through gets this kind of exposure. They still put on, uh, you know, amazing, exciting fights. It's uh, des deserved exposure. Absolutely. Uh, you know, actually, there's more foreign fighters now in super combat than there's ever been. Uh, USA, Netherlands, uh, Great Britain, Italians, uh, from all over the world, Russians, and uh, just showing a little bit of athleticism there by Stoika as uh, he leaps over the ropes. It's a little bit risky before a fight. <laughs> <laughs> it's, yeah, it's a bit like a hurdler going backwards over a hurdle after you win. <laughs> it's, and now, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, introducing it, it first really the fighter out of the blue corner. It's high at 185 it. centimeters, official weight, 95 kilos. His record. 20 wins, four defeats, eight wins by knockout. Fighting out of Jumruk Jim of Bosnia Herzegovina, Zenon, the Sheik Putarak. And his opponent standing across the ring, fighting out of the red corner, official height, 188 centimeters, weight, 95 kilos. His record, 30 wins, four defeats, 20 wins by knockout. Fighting out of respect, Jim of Romania, Andre, Mr. K. O. Stoika. Mr. K. O. Oh, the MC enjoyed saying that one. And uh, his brother in his corner, Bogdan Stoika, another vicious kickboxer. Judge. Smiles from both of the men. Judge. Yeah, good sportsmanship there. A lot of respect between both camps and fighters. Judge. It's nice to see. calm before the storm if uh, Stoika comes out uh, anything like he has done over the last few fights then uh, Poturak who has the blue gloves on from Bosnia Herzegovina is in for a whirlwind Andrei Stoika the Romanian fighting with the red gloves on we're underway three three minute rounds of K1 rules kickboxing you see the difference there we just watched the uh, the Vanny Faye fight where his his, uh, his upper body defense seemed so Discoordinated. You can see with these guys, they're on point with their defence. This is that's the you know good K1. They're both just feeling each other out. I think there's a real mutual respect here. Yeah, definitely. They're just watching each other, feeling each other out, and all of a sudden they'll explode. Again, I think people don't realise. You see an inside leg kick thrown there, and it got checked. You know, oh, fantastic head kick. 
fantastic counter left hook. And actually, uh, you can see uh, Pretorik's eyes go there. Yeah, I said his leg kicks. It's like shin on shin. They're devastated. They hurt. So a little bit of uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Ko's power there. He caught um, Potter right with a lovely left hook. He saw his eyes separate, separate, go a little bit glazy uh, just for a split second. That was thrown with huge power as well. Oh my God! What a knockdown there, Mr. Ko. Well, he gets to his feet. Zenan Potterak, the Bosnian, he gets a standing eight here. That was beautiful technique. Big head kick, followed by with a straight right hand right on the button. Bingo, right in the side of the head. And, uh, well, a lot of men would not get back up from that. He's looking for a left hook to the body, left hook to the head. You see the load up there. Oh, he knows he has the power now. He knows he's got the power. He's just going to just stalk it. Cut the angle, go to the body head. Paturak just covering up here, soaking up a lot of punishment. He looks precise and dangerous. Oh. See how much power he's throwing into that. <laughs> it's terrifying, isn't it? <laughs> I'm telling you, it is. Take your head off if it hits the target. Oh, that was close to landing. He's loading up. I think if he starts working behind a jab or an inside leg kick, he'll open him up like a tin of beans. He'll get that knockout oh, shot. Oh, goodness me, that was back of the head there. He's uh... got to be careful. To be fair, it looked like those are side of the head on the ear. Yeah. If it was the back of the head, he would have been in a lot of trouble then. Yeah, it, it, it's a tough call. Obviously, the referees decided it wasn't uh, anything malicious or on purpose. Like to see Mr. KO stop work. <laughs> Six or seven seconds left, and uh, anything could still happen here. Oh! Tap to the top of his head. That's it. End of the round. Wow. And wow. Kutorak, uh, he's had the kitchen sink thrown at him there. Andrei Stoika. He looks devastating. That right hand is just a bomb. He's fantastic, isn't he? Yeah, so exciting to watch. You see his, uh, his, his shots are devastating. If he starts loading up, I mean, he'll get that knockout. He's got the power to. But if he starts, uh, you know, working his way behind a jab or a nice light leg kick to open the guy up, that's when he, the big knockout will come. Then this is going to be a replay of the knockdown. Right hand. Boom. Oh. Right in the money, so quick. Oh, there it is from another angle. This is beautiful technique, devastating power. Yeah, see, that's what we thought it might have been at the back of the head. That was borderline legal. Yeah, yeah, it did. You're right. It, it hit more the uh, side of the head in the end. It was a, a clubbing shot. And, well, that's how the referee saw it as well. So we're into round number two. Uh, almost certainly Andrei Stoika, the Romanian, and with the red gloves on, is in the lead here. Oh, goodness me! More clubbing fists. And Paturak is down after just over 10 seconds of this uh, round number two. Yeah, he's, uh, he's smiling to the referee. It looks like he's good to go again. He stopped working on a nice jab and leg kicks. Try and keep Mr. KO at bay. Trying to get involved in too many heavy exchanges. You've got to remember, Stoika, both men, 95 kilograms is what they've weighed in at. Who knows what the weight they are now, 100 kilos plus. They're so athletic. So oh, fast. his legs are gone. Oh, completely gone. And Stoika, could this be it? I'm telling you now, he's lucky he went down just before that big head kick came, because that would have knocked his head into That's it, his trainer's had enough, yeah. Here you can see Zeban Paturak has uh, got in there and stopped this. He's had enough, drags him off. Uh, it's, uh, that's his brother, his big brother, by the way. Oh, that's uh, It's sad to see when a fight doesn't... He, his corner stops him, he's upset. But, no, you know, the cornerman... 
They love their they love their fight, so they've got to look after it. Well, of course, he's going to put some face on. There's uh, 72 countries uh, across the world watching this on Eurosport right now. <laughs> Truth is, uh, I think uh, a fate, his fate could have been a whole lot worse there. Yeah, I think uh, he's come his brother out. leaping into his defence. Yeah. I think look he'll thank that. his brother. Yeah, I mean, Stoika, he, he's a crowd pleaser. This is why Super Combat's growing uh, right off the back of someone exactly like this. Uh, they found some real stars Ladies here. He is a big crowd pleaser, but I think he'll go on to be a world pleaser. Round number two, your winner, by knockout, Andre, Mr. K.O. Stoika. Mr. K.O. Andre Stoika takes the win. Even managed to say hello bomb there in the middle of getting his decision. Great stuff from the Romanian. So just seeing some of the action there, some of the highlights, great stuff from Stoika. We're now going to hear from him via our man down on the ground, Sam. Andre, congratulations. Fast this one, huh? Yeah. You know, lucky shot. Lucky shot, lucky shot. I'm sorry for Jenan, he's a, he's a real fighter and a true opponent for me. After this, we are friends, but, you know, this is our job. And, but tonight, no, faster, faster, Relaxing. stronger, Relaxing. Come prepared. Come here. Zenan, it was, it was, yeah, are, you, are you happy about your fight? He's a machine. Yeah, he's a machine, yeah, I know. He, 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 yeah, he, he was prepared. I told him just not no injury. And it is. But you prepared this fight, you prepared this fight, Zenan. I prepared, but he was uh, much, much better. Doesn't matter, we, are. Well, we, we, need, we need to be two people, you need to be two fighters to, to, to make a good fight. looks like me. <laughs> Brothers, all, all four of us. Congratulations, Mr. K.O. He was close to a K.O., but... Uh, Thank Thanks to Eurosport, and uh, see you next time. See you, man. Yeah, we look forward to it. What a humble guy. What a great guy. That was really nice there, uh, his words about his opponent, especially re after Stoika, lucky punch. I don't think so. He was all over Paturak. What a great fight. Plenty more still to come.